Hey guys, um, today I want to share with you a very simple project, which is this one. Um, a few days ago, I lost my air conditioner remote, and as I couldn't buy a new one, I decided to build a very simple one, just to turn on and off my air conditioner. So as you can see, this project is an implementation of the, the two projects I made previously. And by the way, if you didn't watch it, I'll leave the uh, I leave a link in the description so that you can uh, watch them later. Um, well, although this project looks the same as the previous one, I still made a few changes in the code and the circuit. Though, as you can see here, I I added this button and this LED. And in the code, I, I changed it the way it was working. I don't know if you've noticed, but if you upload the previous code, you could turn on the air conditioner. However, as long as the circuit was powered on, it would send a signal to the air conditioner to turn off in every five seconds. So now the code is much better and it will just turn on or off the air conditioner when pressing this button here. And if the circuit is still on, it won't send any signal to the air conditioner unless you press the button again. So um, let me quickly assemble all the elements on a PCB and then I'll explain a few things.
Okay, um, I already assembled all the components on this PCB here, as you can see. It looks pretty nice. Now, with, without all these wires and these connections, as you can see, like so. Um, and the first thing I'd like to explain is um, this transistor here. Let me show it to you guys, okay? So this transistor here. Um, a transistor is a device that you can use to amplify or switch electrical signals. In this case, um, I'm using this transistor to amplify the infrared signal from the remote like you know like we have this uh, infrared led that emits the infrared signal so i'm using this transistor to amplify this signal from this remote to the air conditioner because most air conditioner remote controls rely on infrared technology like in this case i'm using infrared technology so uh, what will this remote control do is emit pulses of infrared light and those pulses are detected by a receiver Usually, uh, this receiver is situa situated on the air conditioner unit itself. Basically, what we have to understand is that when we use a remote like this to turn on or off a device, we basically have uh, two, like, two things. We have one that works as an em emitter and the other one uh, that works as a receiver. As I'm using Arduino Nano here, like this Arduino Nano is working as the brain for this, this entire circuit. So I can only program it to turn on and off the air conditioner because this, uh, this microcontroller, this Arduino Nano only has 32 kilobytes of flash memory and two kilobyte of SRAM, which is pretty small for a project like this one. Um, I'm still working on this project and see if I can build one with all the functions in the future though. So um, this is all for this video and see you next time.